Good morning, YouTube. How you doing? All right. Trying out my new watch, the Sun 2 Ambit 3 Peak, right here. Uh-huh. I'm excited about this. Now, we're going to keep this vlog extra short and concise because I need to edit tonight because in T-22 minus hours and 51 minutes, I'm going to be running up a 14,000-foot peak, which is not really out of the ordinary, except it's a race. The Pikes Peak Ascent is happening tomorrow morning, so come back for that. And uh, so I need to edit this vlog that I'm filming right now on Friday tonight uh, because I need to get it up for you guys before I go run up the mountain. Capiche? Capiche. All right. One more shakeout run, get the legs feeling good, about three miles, and then uh, maybe a few strides just to loosen up, get a little loosey-goosey, and away we go. Back from work, listening to, uh, if you ever are wondering what I'm listening to when I got my headphones in, it's, you know, I'll admit it, I'll admit it, it's usually sports talk. I love sports, I must say, I do love sports, but uh, you gotta be careful, you don't want to waste your time engaging in too much media that centers around sports, but I do love sports. All right, cooking a bagel over here. Mm-hmm. Okay, hold on. Getting little Seth some water. Here you go, buddy. I'm gonna open it. Got it? It's the other way. Here. It's like that. There you go. Got it? Okay. So we're just hydrating, fueling up. Race is in, uh, you know. 16 hours ish and so we're just ch one tip of the day if you are getting ready for an athletic event is to stay out of the heat out of the, especially if it's humid humid heat can really suck your energy out of you so I'm staying inside for the rest of the day not going back out for work um, just chilling so anyway ah <sighs> bagel it is Told you it was gonna be a simple vlog today. Nice and short, nice and uh, sweet. <laughs> With the honey stingers, of course. So, no time lapse tonight. I'm gonna put the camera away. Uh, but, always a good idea to lay out your clothing the night before a race, the night before any big event, really. Whether you're getting ready for a big business meeting or something, you know? So, this is all the running stuff for tomorrow. Down here, we got our warm up shoes here racing shoes there racing socks shorts singlet hat sunglasses warm-up shirt nutrition although what's really nice is i have to carry zero water and i'm going to carry some shop locks in my pocket and that's it so very lightweight um, because there's going to be i think six aid stations over the course of 14 miles which is plenty of aid stations so don't have to carry nutrition which is really really a big bonus. Um, I think I'm gonna call it. And then here over here is a drop bag. In here are warm, warm clothes that I will send to the top in the shuttle. 
And so when I get done running on the top of Pikes Peak, you know, it's it could be could be snowing up there for all we know. It's not supposed to tomorrow, but it could be. No de no no joke. No joke. So anyway, oh yeah, and my watch. So very excited to use this. Alright, see you on Strava everybody. If you uh want to know the results, I'll post them on tomorrow's vlog as well. But um, thanks for coming along the training journey for this race. It's going to be fun. Uh, my brother ran it last year, took ninth out of 2,000 runners, so very good. And I ran it seven years ago. I think I took 17th, so not too shabby, but want to definitely do better this year. All right. See beauty, work hard, run some mountains, or walk, or just admire them. That's cool, too. See you tomorrow.